Yo, what's good everybody? Welcome back to the channel. How y'all doing? How the kids? I am Q, the Costa Rican coach of the Chicago Dragapults. And today we are back here in the ICP G Max League. How y'all doing? How the kids? We're in week four. We are playing this a little later than we normally do, but do here we are. Going against up, oh, hold on. If you press the button, rules will be sent. Going up against the homie Seth, aka Professor Wyatt, aka Mr. Wyatt, aka the owner of the ICP Draft League. How y'all doing? He allowed Mario and I to run this G Max season. So big shout outs to the homie. And uh, here we are now facing off against him and his Al Bundy Bisharp. But alright, my man has available to him G Max Gengar, Mel Metal, Club Fable, Blaziken with speed boost, which kind of, if it just gets up at SD and it's life orb, it kind of just wins. It's kind of stupid. Swampert, Noivern, Drapion, Rotom Frost, Articuno, Kangaskhan, and Pinsir. So, once again, another, uh, another, uh, Crazy Zamazenta Crown like matchup. Obviously, like as it always is, Zamazenta Crown kind of just goes all the way in. Zewar has got a weird matchup as well. Flapple looking pretty good. Um, Hydreigon is scarfed. Kind of my like initial. If Blaze can only gets up a plus one, I can try to bait it with this thing to to not protect and to just CC, and then I can drop a Draco and kill it, which would be really nice. Otherwise, um, Sloking and Santa can live a hit. If they're not plus two, if they're at plus two, Santa Cana is literally the only mon that even has a chance to live any hit, and it uh, has a chance. That's that's all I'm gonna say. But yeah, that's this. This is the team uh, that we're gonna be bringing uh, into the battle, and uh, very nervous about this one because, like I said, uh, that freaking Blaziken can, can literally just get up a plus two and just win at any point in the game. I I just can't give it the opportunity. And I hope I, uh, I hope I just don't. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Forgot to mention, link to the, to my opponent's channel in the description down below, as well as all the other coaches in the ICP. Go check the homie out. He does bring the Kangaskhan. I fucking knew it. I fucking knew it. No Noivern is huge. Hydreigon shouldn't be scarfed anymore. But it's whatever. It is what it is. They could lead with with Drapion and get up a T spike. Oh, no Noivern means Burnt Snake is like a good lead. But I also, oh, I want to, I do not want to use it that way. I want to use it, uh, I obviously want to use it, uh, in a different way. I want to use it as the, as the, uh, as the Blaziken, uh, Fallout, uh, Fallback. I don't know. I want to, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. This is going to be tough. Because they could just lead Drapion and get up a T-Spike, which would be pretty crazy against me. Because I am not like boots on everybody. Um, but if they leave Pert, I'll be very upset because I now have to honestly do. you. I don't think they'll lead Drapion. They might. I don't really have a good switch into it, to be honest. Um, let's see. Where is my Slow King? I wouldn't die from a knock. It would suck, though. But I could get off a Fat Scald. I guess this is what we're going to have to do. Uh, yeah, I guess this is what we're doing. Good luck, I found my opponent. He brought the Kangaskhan. I'm assuming for Blaseth because Blaseth looked stupid dummy free against him. And I also forgot to take a picture of his team. So let's see what happens. Hopefully, they didn't lead off with Drapion. But I am thinking they will. Uh, just because T-Spikes look really, really good against me. As they always do with Hazards. Drapion, they do lead off with it. Okay, well, I mean, at least they'll be enticed to click Knock. And I can just get off a of Scald. The one week I don't run counter. It would have been perfect here. Um, but we also will look at the Pokemon and then take a picture. Like so. Alright, good stuff. Alright, but yeah, we will just Scald. Um, because we really just don't want to give them a free T-Spike. And this will, yeah, see? Damn, I fucking knew it, man. So hopefully, we get a burn on this turn. Which would be huge for us. And we can scout some damage. That looks to be a bit of... HP invested just because it's supposed to do 40% minimum and that is like looks like less than 40 They might go for t-spike again, which would be crazy honestly um, But you know, it's their it's their prerogative to do so they do only go for one which is pretty good good for us We eat that's that knockoff So hopefully they uh, Go oh my god, they're not okay. Well, it looks like they're gonna they're just gonna let this go down I mean, they don't have a Skull Switch in. It kind of makes sense for them to just let this go down. Um, I really do not like that T-Spike. They get up another one. That's terrible for us, honestly. 
Maybe they just go hard Gengar now. Which would be good, because then I could just kill it with Zama the next turn. So honestly, I'd be okay with it. If they go hard, if they go Gengar now. They could go Clef too. Uh, I think against Clef, I, I think both I would go, yeah. So I, I honestly, I kind of will, I could just sack this and get and then just go to Zama later. I really don't like that because this is kind of good for Kangaskhan pivoting. This is actually really good for Blaziken as well. I could just go hard. I could just go hard. Uh, I could just go hard Hydreigon. I'll just go hard Hydreigon. I will hard Hydreigon on U-turn. Why not? That's what I'll do. Fucking two T-spikes. I knew it. Hypnosis. Blunder policy? Yeah, that's actually pretty crazy. Um, <laughs> what? Instant blunder policy proc? He might just win. <laughs> Am I wrong? Wait a minute. Hold on. Because I think, I don't think Focus Blast can kill Zama from full. Zama, Zenta. But at plus one, it could. So, but if he Dynamaxes, it'll, it'll never kill. So, yeah. So, um, we have to get them to show us the Dazzling Gleam. So, I guess if I live, I'll just, I'll just, nah, I'll just Dark Pulse. Uh, yeah, this doesn't matter. I'll Dark Pulse. He Focus Blasts and misses. That's terrible. That's just terrible. And when I was talking about Focus Blast landing, I was I mean, not landing, uh, like, when I was talking about surviving a Focus Blast, it wasn't Hydreigon, it was Zama. Zama, Zama survives. Hydreigon also had a chance to survive, unless they're modest. Let's see, if they're timid, I had an 18% chance to die. So that means I would have had a 82% chance to uh, to live, obviously. But if, then, but if they were modest, then, hmm, I don't know. They do go out into the Blaziken. Oh my god. Oh my god, Dark Pulse only does 30 to something. I have to... They get a, they get two speed boosts no matter what. Oh my god, like... Uh, this sucks. Because they get two speed boosts no matter what. Damn, this is why I wish I wasn't fucking choice locked. Dark Pulse. Dark Pulse has a... Mm. So, okay, hold on. So Dark Pulse after Life Orb actually has a chance to... to, to after two rounds of Life Orb... I'm just gonna Dark Pulse. Fuck me, dude. I'm, I hate putting myself in this position. Please flinch. Please flinch. Flinch! So it's Dance. I lost. I literally lost. Because they can just do it again. They can just do it again now. They can literally just do it again. And then I lost, lost. Do I have Sucker Punch on Santa Con? I think I do have Sucker Punch on my guy. So yeah, I'll Dark Pulse again. Because uh, we should be faster. They protect. Of course they do. Why wouldn't they protect? They should literally SD again. I hate this, bro. I literally lose. I just lose. I guess I had to go hard Santa Conda, but not even, because I would have, I would have gotten enough, enough chip would have been for toxic. Yeah, I just lost. This sucks. Wait. Okay, here's what I can do. I have to, I have to, have them hit multiple close combats, and then kill with quick attack. That's not my only out. That's my only out. Close combat one, okay. Jesus, look at that fucking damage, man. At least they, they only did it once. Okay, wait, so we can scout. Plus two. Mmm, they actually might not be. Were they life orb? I don't remember them take. I don't remember seeing them take life orb chip.
Um, we'll slash shock. In case they're Pasho Berry. Random Pasho Berry. They do knock. Okay. Wait, so they have knock. So plus two. No life orb chip, right? Oh my, I'm freaking out right now. Yeah, no life orb chip. Yeah, no life orb chip. My Sanaconda should live. With no life orb chip, like even after a, a, a round of a, what's of what's it called? Yeah, I guess alternatively I go Zama and they're at minus one quick attack. We we'll do thirty two. Yeah, okay, so that's not it. So yeah, we gotta go Santa Conda, just live. We just gotta go Santa Conda and live, I guess. Oh my fucking god, man. I guess we can go Santa Conda and just fire away a, a Grab Apple. Or a, a Max Apple. We should live every hit, um, and so we will Earthquake. Oh my god, thank god for no Life Orb. Unless they're, I guess they could be... They could be Shaka. They withdraw! Sent out Pert, okay. So is this Fizz Death Pert? I'm assuming. It took about 20%. Not even. Swamper. Not lefties. Must be Rindo. Yeah, that's Fizz Duff. Um, I guess we could just get to go Hydreigon. I don't know. And click Flash Cannon. And then the, the Blaze can another chance. <gasps> Opportunity to SD. <clears throat> we could also potentially rest with Sanicon at some point. I think now, here's what I need to do. Is get Flapple in and max airstream and just win, hopefully. And just hopefully win. I don't know. I'm very scared. I'm very terrified. Stealth rocks. Good on you, mate. I wish this is where I wish I had defog. Um hmm. If I U turn and they stay in. I think they don't care what I do, because this gives them Blaziken opportunity, like, regardless of what I do. I think. I do want a U-turn, though. So, I, I think I just will. <sighs> of course. They should flip turn here, I guess, right? I literally can only go... I literally can only go Zera. No Melmetal, I just realized, as well. I can only go Zera. And I will be grass nodding here. No, I will be in close combating actually. If they if they don't flip turn. Actually, regardless of what they do, I most likely will close combat. They do flip turn. If they don't go clef, I'll close combat. I'm so scared. This blaze is just gonna win at some point. But let's see what they go out into. They could go Kangaskhan and just fake me out. Fake out. Just click fake out. Waste a turn. Um, I guess if they have the fake out on Kangaskhan, they probably go out now. Yeah, okay. So they do have it. Honestly, I'm okay with that. With Zera clicking. Uh, honestly, I'll click CC, actually. This, that makes a lot more sense. It only doesn't... Because they should they should click Earthquake here. Yeah, so I'll just, I'll just click CC. They go back out. Okay, they go back out on a pert. Okay, well, I mean, that's kind of what we wanted anyway, so that's cool. We'll get this chip. Uh, should do about that much. Probably should have done more, but it looks like to be like they might be fizzed up. But now I think we get to go out into Flapple. And max Airstream. I think we have to do it now. I could actually go out in a Zama and, and what's it called, but I think we're going to go Flapple and Max Airstream. I think that's what I want to do. We're going to take rocks, we're going to take T-Spikes, double T-Spikes, so we're going to be toxic, essentially. This one has been so fucking nerve-wracking so far, this is crazy. He didn't Dynamax? I don't give a fuck, I'm going to. Like, he should have, I don't know why he didn't. He wanted to land the Focus Blast, I guess, I don't know. Uh, we will Dynamax, and we will Max Airstream, because this should kill. Um, yeah, even if you, like, Max Max Fizz Death. 
Uh, so let's just max airstream, boys. Let's just do it. They stay in. Let's go. They should knock it out. And then we can max airstream again on the Blaziken's Protect, if that's what it wants to do. Um, and then it should probably KO through Protect, I would imagine. I would imagine. And then every other guy, we just click Tartness. We'll see how, what, how it goes. This should kill, hopefully. Hopefully my calcs aren't off. Let's go, Flapple. Let's go. Shout out to Flapple. So yeah, if they go Clef, I Tartness. If they go Clef, I Tartness. If they go... I suck a punch, right? Yeah, okay, I suck a punch. And so if they go Clef, I Tartness. If they go Kangaskhan, I might max Airstream. Depending. Because I will, I will assume they do go Kangaskhan. Kangaskhan. I am going to assume that they're Spadef, not Fizdef. And a Tartness would kill, so I kind of have to go for the Tartness then. If they're, if they're just Spadef and not Fizdef. Um, so yeah, that's what we'll go for. I would like to get up another Max Airstream. Oh, they go Blaziken. If they go Blaziken, this thing dies. Clefable. Okay, so I can get up another, another Max Airstream, te technically. Not technically, actually. There's no technicalities for it. It's actual. Actual factual. This should die. Oh my god. Oh no, because they go Kangaskhan again. This is this was them making sure I only get up one. I will sucker punch the blaze again. I don't give a fuck. I will be sucker punching that thing. Cause it's just Kangaskhan and Blaziken, right? I'm pretty sure. I could fly on their protect, which would be pretty crazy. Oh, they go Blaziken now. Wait a minute, this is free. Um, I actually think Wormin is the better play. No, because if they protect... Yeah. If they protect, they should still kill him, I think. Okay, never mind. They just sacked this. Let's go Flapple. Let's go Flapple. This is why you Dynamax. It should have dynamaxed. But I guess in their in their head, like it's probably makes sense. It make it does make sense. Not probably it makes it does make sense because um They would have killed the Hydreigon for sure. And then if I, and then I go Zama, then they have a higher chance to kill the Zama in little form than they do in big form because focus blast damage goes down when you dynamax. So um yeah. If they want to reveal Sucker Punch here, they can. Uh, that's fine. We will grab Apple. I should have outraged. They do have Sucker Punch. Living! Let's go. Hustle boosted. Outrage literally would have killed, but it is what it is. And he was Rocky Helmet. No, no, no. I'm done. I'm done. I'm life orb. I'm life orb. I'm life orb. <laughs> Shut up. What's wrong with me? I'm so stupid. Um, we will finish this off with the homie. Wait, no, burnt snake. Finish it off with burnt snake. We will not be going out in Zama in this one. Zama will not be used, and we will be clicking earthquake. Oh my god, this one was a nail biter, boys and girls. And burnt snakes. Drain punch? Oh no. Oh, that's doing fucking nothing. Tell me this three of KOs, please. Please, game. Tell me I didn't make the wrong choice. I could have went Zama easy, but I wanted to get a kill with burnt snake. Burnt snake! Burn snake. Let's fucking go, man. Oh my god, that was such a. That was such a. I thought I was. If that was Life War Blaziken, dude, I thought it was over. Like dead ass. I wonder what item he had. Maybe a maybe E belt. Maybe something to just to, just to boost close combat. I don't know. Either way, that is going to be our ICP week four. We do remain 
undefeated, the only undefeated coach in the league so far. Knock on wood. Don't want to jinx all that. But big shouts to Zama Zenta for holding it down in the back. Big shouts to the homie uh, Zeora. Um, big shouts to Hydreigon for baiting in, uh, not baiting in, for dodging the Gengar Focus Blast. Huge shout outs to the homie Flapples. And uh, Slow King did its thing, and Santa Conda did its damn thing. So, yeah, man, that's going to be the game. If y'all like what you saw and you saw what you like, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you're new. Go check out the homie. Link to his channel in the description down below, as well as all the other coaches in the ICP. But with that being said, I'm going to get up out of here. If y'all like what you saw and you saw what you like, don't forget to like, subscribe, and I already said this. Peace. I love Burnt Snake.